Father Alexander, your film should definitely win an Oscar. You should find a film festival, whether in your homeland of Ukraine, or in an appropriate Greek institute, or in Russia, or at the Khan. Why not? Everyone will be enchanted by the simplicity of the scenes, by the innocence, as though you were watching children. Saint Macarius of Egypt used to say, Christians are like infant babes, like little children, infants, even younger, as Christ said. If we do not become like these children, we shall not enter the kingdom of heaven. And Abbot Gregory, even though decades had passed, he had surpassed 80 years of age. He had remained a child in heart, in his face, in light, in his eyes, in his words, with such consistency. And we knew him when he didn't have any white hair at all, when he was a young clergyman who lived with saints. He lived close to St. Augustine, Metropolitan of Florida. He lived close to the disciple of St. Nectarios, St. Philothios Zervakos. He lived close to St. Amphilochios, also a spiritual child of St. Nectarios. He was also a personal friend of my elder, St. Emilianos. And he has written a brilliant history in Patmos as well, when he was at Kuvari, at a hermitage of Elder Amphilochios, where a young student at that time, Dimitrios Arcondonis, who is now the ecumenical patriarch, spent his vacation, a 15-year-old boy then. And Father Gregory, Saint Gregory of Dochiario and of the Aegean Sea, as he used to sign his secret and open letters, taught him to swim in the Sea of Patmos. But also, all the brothers with him, and it touched me, because Father Philotheos of blessed memory was the son of my professor, at the University of Athens in the Theological School, Stylianos Papadopoulos of blessed memory, who was deemed worthy to become great schema monk Gerasimos, as you narrated to us so beautifully with your excellent Greek. And he was buried at the monastery of Dochiariu, and all the fathers and the present abbot Amphilochios who bears the name of St. Amphilochios, elder of Father Gregory of Blessed Memory. The film is so rich that one could say that it is the fruit of knowledge, of science, of prayer, of love toward monasticism, and of love toward the monastery of Dochiariu. The archangels Michael and Gabriel had brought you there, and they welcome every pilgrim who comes, as they are situated on their columns, which Abbot Gregory had erected there in order to welcome people. The archangels, who had saved the child, whom others had thrown into the sea to drown him, so that they might take the treasure that he had found and God destined him for the monastery of Dochiariu, and this glorious monastery was built, which is a vessel containing the hearts of pious lay pilgrims and indeed of the monks. And this monastery has the skull of St. Dionysius the Areopagite, my saint. And indeed, when I had venerated at the monastery, an elderly monk who was there said to me, 
Your saint is here. Stay here and you will be our abbot. But I wanted to be close to my elder until I would be the first to expire close to him. But God, through my elder, had other plans. And he has deemed me worthy today of receiving you at our monastery of St. John Capodistrias, the great leader of the Greeks, after the last emperor of Byzantium. And the saint's mind and heart were greater than that of your patron, Alexander the Great, because he played a role in Europe and in the world greater than that of Alexander the Great. And if Europe wants to find its health because it is ill, not due to old age, since it is surnamed the old continent, but due to its apostasy from God and its heresies. Because St. Justin Popovich used to say, there are three downfalls of the human race, that of Adam, of Judas, and of the Pope. And John Capodistrias, whose primary occupation was that of a physician, is the healer of the souls of the Greeks and of the nations, not only of Europe, not only of Holy Russia, but of the entire world. Anyone could stoop down into his writings, his charters, and the charter that he wrote for Switzerland saved Switzerland, like a link in Europe, free, autonomous, autocephalous, which does not belong to the European community, yet has managed for centuries ever since Capodistrias to be the wealthiest and most hospitable country in the world. As you spoke so well, that in Switzerland, that which is happening in Kiev would not have happened and would never happen, where they are driving out the monks from their monastery, where each one of them has spent 60 or 70 years there, having given their lives to Christ and to the mystery of monasticism, which is the mystery of the future age, because then all of us will be monks like angels of God. The world will thank you if you show this film at more theaters. May televisions be filled, just like people are now listening to Father Evangelos Papanikolaou to his fiery sermons like those of St. Chrysostom. And people would see your film even more so, which is so simple, showing the daily work of the monks of Dochiario as they follow the monk, Abbot Gregory of Blessed Memory, skillful in diverse arts and knowledgeable in so many fields, who taught them so many types of work to take hold of the soil, as our grandfathers used to say, and make it gold and to perform these miracles at Dochiario, where they have worn you out with so much heavy labor. And as you were working, you were thinking about when you would lie down, so that you might have more strength to continue the next day with the monastery's heavy labor. He was the strictest, but also the sweetest elder. His smack was a caress, like the caress of Christ, who said to the dead girl, Tabitha, kumi, young girl, arise. And the daughter of Jairus rose. That was who Abbot Gregory was, whom you came to love so much. And out of your love for him, you would leave your spouse, the deaconess, every year for so many months so that you could go to your angels, the fathers of Dochiario, and to your angels. God took you to the best monastery of Mount Athos, and when you marveled at the beauty there and at the fathers, in the end you said, 
May I return to Dojiario quickly. May God deem us worthy as well to venerate at the monastery of Dojiario. And even if he does not deem us worthy of venerating Abbot Gregory, who is with the saints and great fathers of your church, and he had become a spiritual father and elder to you and a contemporary saint of the Holy Mountain. I thank you profoundly that I was with you today and with Mr. Sergius, who had just come from Portugal. It may be that we see you again and often, and tomorrow at the liturgy of the pre-sanctified gifts at which you will serve as deacon, may everyone enjoy listening to the hymn, Let My Prayer Rise, which you chanted so beautifully today. Good Resurrection. See you.